Okay, I rewrote the function a little bit to look like this. Nine, f of x is 9 times the cosecant squared of 1 third x. And we're going to use the power rule followed by successive applications of the chain rule. So to find f prime, we will take this exponent 2 times the 9. It gives us 18. Reduce the exponent by 1. So we still have that cosecant of 1 third x. But then when we took the derivative of cosecant, this was like the inside function right here. And we have to take the derivative of that. And the derivative of cosecant is negative cosecant still of 1 third x cotangent of 1 third x. But now we have to apply the chain rule again. We have to take the derivative of this inside function, which is 1 third. And if we multiply the constants together, we have an 18, a negative 1, and a one-third, that's negative six. We've got two factors of cosecant of one-third x. So I can re write those as cosecant squared of one-third x. And then we still have this factor of cotangent of one-third x. And that looks like it matches option two. Okay, now if I go over here to Desmos, I can show you how to verify this result. Here's the graph of the original function. If I use the Desmos derivative operator and call g of x the derivative of f of x, that's what it looks like. And if I graph h of x as the answer that we just came up with, you can see that row 2 and row 3 are identical which confirms that this h of x is the correct answer. So there you go. Hope that helped. If you have any questions, post a comment.